Hello and welcome to my playthrough of Blitzkrieg. I've just completed the initial conference, which was the invasion of Poland, as you can see there. Um, I was playing on a normal, I scored 840 points, uh, which wasn't too bad. So we'll move on to the, the next conference. I also attacked and captured Warsaw, uh, both A and B. Which is great. Uh, okay, so I am getting air supply, which is handy. And let me see. I have a choice of the historical track, which will give me these two scenarios. Visor tag and Trondheim. Or if I go back to the strategic map. Early attack on France would have me going through Faint to Antwerp, Fall Brown, and Panzerschlag Paris. So these are great scenarios. I, I enjoy them a lot. But uh, since I'm recording this, I'm going to do the historical track, even though I, I do like the early attack on France, especially uh, this scenario Fall Brown. Um, the Maginot Line is nearly impregnable in places, but there are gaps as well in the Saar area. Waterlogged soil prevents the construction of heavy concrete fortifications, and further south, the Swiss brace themselves for a possible attack aimed at circumventing the Maginot. Neither the French nor the Swiss have the mobile reserves available to contain a decisive breakthrough in this area. And that's what you do. You go through Switzerland, um, pummel your way through the Maginot Line and, you know, head for Paris. It's good fun. Uh, but, like I said, I'm not going to do the early attack on Paris or on France. I'm going to do the historical track, which gives us scenarios. Visor tag and Tron time. Okay, for this conference will be exclusively using OKH, so I'll go to OKH and bump it up. Uh, in this campaign, OKH is used as an abstract representation of field commands in charge of operations in Scandinavia and the Balkans. So, uh, I'll need all kinds of bits and pieces for this guy. I'm not going to make the same mistake I made with my HGB and HGA. I'm going to give them full command radius from the start. They'll also need some operational bits and bobs. Activate intel as well. Uh, I think I'll give them supply and that should be that should be me good enough. Okay, I'll close that for now. And that's that. I think it's time to, to start, really. Let me see. Approve plan. And let's go. So here we are, Weezer Tag. For years, Germany has run a boom-bust economy in its effort to re-establish its armed forces at breakneck speed. One of many limitations on the German armaments industry is its lack of direct access to sufficient raw materials. It desperately needed iron ore, or its desperately needed iron ore comes from Sweden and has to be transported along the coast of neutral Norway during the harsh Nordic winters. Fearing an allied invasion of Norway that would block these shipments, Hitler has decided to preemptively put Norway and Denmark under the Reich's protection. So now we have nine turns, and let's start. So this will be a coastal invasion of Norway. Um, it'll be a tricky scenario to, to get down. But all we can do is our best to make sure we disrupt our enemy's plans, keep them off balance, disrupt their supply, maintain our own, and it should be okay. 
So visa tags, the scenario briefing reads the OK dis OKW dispatch is Operation Weezerbung is getting off to a rocky start. Although Denmark seems likely to surrender within a matter of hours, Norwegian coastal fortifications in drawback sound have managed to thwart our coup de main at Oslo. What remains of this force will have to land further south and make its way towards Oslo on land. Maybe some paratroopers can assist them in their efforts. Further to the east, additional naval and air landings will seize strategically important ports and airfields. This must be completed quickly so the Luftwaffe can deploy forces to interdict naval transport and ground operations. Okay. So, where can my HQ go? He can go at Oslo, Friedrichstad, Christiansen. That's it. What kind of turn two? Where do my Wow, okay. So I really have to capture these airports straight away. My turn three is the same. Right, that's interesting. One whole air supply. So if we drop him in here, he will now pave the way for landing here. Better make sure I can. Yep, and let me see. He's fully suppressed. He is fully suppressed. Now, 100% retreat. And this guy's 100% retreat. him here. Now, one, two, three, four. Do I chance him? Let's move in a bit. I don't think he's good enough to land. So I'm going to I'm going to let me see. Decisions, decisions. If I go for there and capture it, it'll be great. If I don't, I'll be really struggling. So I'll land in here. Oh no, I could. Okay, that is a bit disappointing. <laughs> 
Okay. Um, there's nothing really more for me to do this turn. I can land my HQ, and I think he needs to go here. And I'll put in my supply. I'll put it in there. Is there any point? No, look, I'm good for the moment. I could always... That'll take him out of the game. And he's still supplied. <coughs> okay. Um, right, let's move along. I know there's trucks available, but I don't want to use them yet. Interesting that he hasn't moved into the airport. And if I move in, I still have make sure he's prepared. Wow. They've left Oslo undefended. So, let's start deploying our forces, not just yet, okay let's move this guy up this way. for supply there. All good. So with him moving over this way, once he's in supply I'll race him along to Christiansund. This is looking good enough. So I have to capture Kongsberg and Honefoss by turn six. That's interesting. that I can supply I should probably give these guys some supply and I'll move him up why is he moving so slow he's on rail no he's not that's a mistake are all coming in here. So I 
start Do I really want to? Need to protect these two places. <coughs> and uh, slow and steady wins the race, I think. Now I do have plenty of cards, I have extra bombers, I also have extra naval support, and I have air supply, so I have a good set of cards. I'm going to hang on to them for the moment. Move on, let's see what kind of reaction the Norwegians give. Actually, just keeping him locked up there for the moment. Okay, that was bound to be the case. Now, where does my supply? How far did that's as far as it goes? So I might as well just go for a charge. troops in Stavanger. So Vingen by turn six. And I have to be getting my cavalry racing up that way. Kongsberg by turn six. Honofus by turn six. Hammer and Kong's finger. By turn seven. Let's push up that way. Gonna be out of supply. Hmm. 
Be close run thing. Oh, sorry, I forgot to bring in my my troopers. Myself open to counterattack from this side, but there's nothing appearing here anyway. So it's all good for the moment. Interesting that he's, these guys are moving away from the HQ. Seems they only have the one HQ, so Some of these units, HMK guard. Take these places. Fairly rapidly. How's my supply looking there? He's still in supply. he getting his supply from there. So next turn if I were to cut him off that could be Okay, let's end this turn. Turn four. It's getting close.
Okay. So why are they all nice? Oh, come on. Ooh, interesting, okay. Hopefully, I'll be able to get it good. More. I'm running out of time. Okay, turn five. This is gonna be close. Is he even going to be able to go up there? He's not because he's cavalry, probably. Um, let's see what happens. going right to the wire. But I'm getting there. And that needs to be taken this turn, so I've not accomplished that.
and he's not moving. And nobody can reach it. objectives but at least I managed to capture all of my main objectives on time so that's good hopefully I won't regret not getting the extra cash too much in the future and I'll just end the scenario okay well that was Weezer tag Primary objectives taken on time with a score of 259. Nine enemy kills with 14 prisoners. Took a lot of losses, five infantry, but it's done. Excellent. And I didn't have to use any of my cards, which I can save for Tron time. I'm sure I'll need them. Okay, well, move on to the, the next video, Tron time, and sure, hope you enjoy.